see each other like repulsively. They did. They never, even if in storyline, they didn't really yeah, hate each other. They've been no. friends probably for yeah. 25 years, as long as they've both yeah. been there. So yeah. they're the heads of the happen. locker room. Yeah. It would have been very easy for Taker to just leave. Mm -hmm. You know, stay in character. But it was very cool yeah. that he did that. Vince let him. Mm -hmm. so, well, I like that. Well, so the fans know he's not really a dead man. <laughs> really I mean, because of uh, maybe 10 years ago, he was the American bad ass. Yeah, you know, yeah. Like a, Come on. a yeah. bicycle, according to Kurt. <laughs> <laughs> so, anything else about WrestleMania, guys? No, uh, I think yeah. that was it. It was very Come good. Come to Philly. Yeah, 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 definitely. It was good. Mm -hmm. And well worth the wait for Sean and Taker. Yeah. 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 And I'm glad they made that the main event. Me too, yeah. Him, but he's just, uh, I know. God. I think the Hall of Fame class was okay. Yeah. What is their best class? Uh, let the rumors start for Sean for next year already. <laughs> I did like the Owen Hall of Fame 2011 sign yeah. of the crowd. It was cool. Yeah. yeah. See that shirt that Brett had on? No. With no. that night. Yeah, yeah. Monday, yeah. Monday, Monday night. night. It had night, Owen yeah. and Brick together on it. Yeah, he had him like in a headlock and stuff. Oh, uh, cool. they had that DVD that's coming out. Yeah, yeah. Soon, the heart. Yeah, I didn't see there was an Owen chant. That yeah, cool. yeah, I heard that. <laughs> yeah, so that's just, that's cool. That's cool. In some uh, WWR breaking, breaking, breaking news, because mm -hmm. you got well by the time this gets up, it'll have happened, but <laughs> <laughs> it hasn't even happened yet on TV as we speak. Jack Swagger, at Tuesday's SmackDown tapings, cashed in his money in the bank on Chris Jericho to win the World Championship. Fuck Him and you, Swagger. <laughs> Him and Ed, Edge and Jericho were having a confrontation and whatnot about Mania. Edge fears Jericho. He leaves. Swagger runs down with the referee, power bombs him, and covers him and wins the belt. So I... Uh, which is kind of odd. Uh, yeah. A uh, heel taking the belt from another heel. And how did Swagger go from... He, could, he hasn't been on Raw in like three months. So he's, he's going to SmackDown. He's losing on superstars every week. To Primo, mm -hmm. for God's sakes. And all of a sudden he's beating Jack Swagger over the belt. I don't know. I think it's a Sheamus know. push. I like Swagger more than Sheamus. So. I like Swagger too. He's <laughs> better. Yeah. I don't know. It's, uh, and again, we all cried a bit about we're tired of seeing the same guys wrestle. We need new people. What did we say on here, though? You're going to expect the money in the bank earlier than usual because of that pay-per-view in yeah. July. So, uh, definitely early. Uh, <laughs> and I don't mind that Vince is putting new guys up there. That's yeah. fine. But you can't put a guy like Jack Swagger, who's lost for fucking three months in a row every <laughs> week on Raw, when superstars, the guys like Primo and Santino, <laughs> you know, he kept throwing him out of the ring. <laughs> uh, that he should be beating. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, now he's world champion. Fans aren't going to buy it. I'm not going to buy it. Yeah. And his first win was the Money in the Bank match. And what really is going to hurt him is if he loses it in like three weeks. Like, like, like Edge the first time. If he just keeps it warm, that he loses it to Edge. Yeah. Well, he's got nothing now. I, I assume I bit. assume he's moving to SmackDown. Word was he was going to get drafted anyway to SmackDown either way, whether he's won the title or Money in the Bank or not. He fits better over there, I Maybe Dolph Ziggler are the same guy, so... Maybe they'll move Dolph to Raw or FCW or something. <laughs> or TNA. Yeah. In, in some other WWE news, Bill Goldberg, Mr. Celebrity Apprentice, if anyone's watching that, uh, is in negotiations with WWE... For licensing and use of his image in like video games and stuff, talk of him being in the Hall of Fame next year as well. Uh, we'll see. No. You bird. <laughs> Three bird. <laughs> but in his it supposedly has to do that he had his son and that's why he needs the money kind of thing. That's why he's talking in negotiations with Vince. And he said what, he didn't. He ain't making no money from his bull run on speed. <laughs> <laughs> I guess not. Because so, nobody's watching it. So it'll be another guy in the rush with a, a version of the spear? Yeah. And and that was the other thing. They asked him about a wrestling return, and he said he doesn't rule it out. So maybe a couple matches or something, because God knows that last match we all saw of him was tarnished to <laughs> him and Lesnar. He should bring Brock, Brock back. Yeah, except they don't have enough money for him. Hey, <laughs> really have Brock, at least he can wrestle. And he doesn't want to come back. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I want his wife. Yeah, if, he does, if he does come back, I hope, you know, it's not, I'm not doing comedy shit. <laughs> I'm not as old fucking, you know, I'm the 
King Shit. Yeah. I, I I've like had a peaky in five seconds. seconds and well, it can't be. Maybe, uh, maybe it'll just be a host spot or something, too, you know? As, or oh, throw him and Cena in a one match at, like, a big SummerSlam or, like, a big pay-per-view. Well, I root for Goldberg, man. But <laughs> I just so okay, anybody yeah. that faces Cena, you know, I root for Goldberg. It'll yeah. probably be <laughs> Cena would still beat him in five moves. Yeah. <laughs> So, yeah, I don't know about that. Yeah. <laughs> I, I could see Vince why he was one in the rest. I mean, if I'm going to give you money and I want something out of it, you just sort of look and fucking shit. I, yeah, a muscle-bound, bald-headed guy. Can't create that on a video game anywhere. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I can create Goldberg. Jeez, and they, I think they still have his moves in the moveset. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so they give him yeah. 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 Whatever. Well, how hard is it? You give him a spear and give him a jackhammer. They have. Yeah. They don't call it the jackhammer. They call it something, something else. Something else. I don't know. Yeah. Some kind of suplex they call yeah. it. Yeah. All right. Uh, in TNA news, there is some. Uh, <laughs> there were some TNA releases this week. Uh, Consequences Creed was released. Just, I guess, because Hogan's there. and <laughs> Face the consequences. <laughs> yeah. The pink slip. <laughs> Those were his consequences. Which is a shame because he's a really talented. Wrestler. Yeah, I like them. Yeah. yeah. Hogan comes in and it's kind of funny. It looks like WCW. Old guys at the top, young guys at the bottom, never on fucking TV. And give you two years, TNA, then you'll be out of business. Yeah. And unfortunately for everyone, those young up-and-comers, the nasty boys, <laughs> Hogan's bright new stars, <laughs> got released as knobs uh, was at a TNA function, and Spike TV executives were present, and they didn't like uh, his. They were unhappy with his behavior. So I don't know what he was doing or whatever. But uh, thank God, <laughs> we don't have to see those old fossils anymore. More airtime for Generation Me. He was shaking his armpits in yeah. people's face. <laughs> Probably was drunk right. and obnoxious. Yeah, or yeah. maybe it was just like because he knew they were there. Maybe he figured there might have been cameras that maybe. maybe trying to kind of sort of stay in character. Who knows? Yeah. I, they should have been there in the first place. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I won't miss any Nancy boys. No, no. <laughs> <I've been. laughs> Most of the Dudleys are happy about that. Yeah. Yeah, now they're the oldest team in North Carolina. They're the fossils. Yeah, like yeah, 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 we all do. All right. Well, the WWE Hall of Fame was this past week, and we all saw how that went. <laughs> so now we're going to continue on, though, with the WWR Hall of Fame. My latest inductee this week is Mick Foley. Good choice. Yeah. <laughs> I, I can't think of anything bad you could possibly say about Mick Foley. Nope. I don't think there is anything. No. Nope. Super cool guy. Yeah, we, we've like all, that. not to drop names, because I wouldn't want to do that, but we've all met him at least more than twice. <laughs> or twice, or whatever. <laughs> and uh, he's an awesome guy. Three-time WWE champion. TNA world champion. Even though he didn't remember me. Yeah. The first ever hardcore champ. Yeah. Multiple-time tag champ with Rock the Rock and Kane, he was, and uh, Al Austin. Snow. Yep. Yeah, Al Snow, I forgot about that. Austin. TNA Legends champ there for a little bit <laughs> yeah. against Nash. So he's definitely got yeah. some of the credentials to do it. Uh, New York Times bestseller. Definitely, yeah. He's probably going to be the first wrestler ever to have a number one selling book. A couple of them. Yeah. His yeah. very first <laughs> book was yeah, really, really, very good. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I have read that one. Yeah. That blew critics away. I mean, I, I, I knew people that weren't wrestling fans that were reading it. Yeah. Book. yeah. And when you think of Mick Foley, they are the most, like, barbaric matches <laughs> that we've ever seen. You're probably going to think of the ones Mick Foley's in, that Hell in the Cell. Yeah, Some of his getting thrown off the Hell in the Cell. Yeah. yeah. Some an image I'll never get out of my No, head. definitely. I like and Foley because yeah. between that and then thumbtacks. <laughs> yeah. I like Foley because he looks like a regular guy. Mm -hmm. I mean, you see guys like Cena and them, and I mean, they're built, they're, they look like wrestlers. Yeah. Foley looks like a regular guy. Mm -hmm. He's not in any kind of shape. He's not a muscle guy. He's not a serious hell, he's a fly around the ring kind of guy. Mm -hmm. and, he, and he was a fan that he had pursued yeah. his dream. He, he was just, inspired. Yeah. Well, he was always a regular guy. He just... Yeah. He's, always like he's, he's one of those guys too that like you know he's not like a lot of these other guys you hear about if he's out at a park or something and people ask him for an autograph he's not you know he'll stop and sign you know yeah. he can't mm -hmm. sign for everybody but you yeah. know he'll try and get you know 
I've never heard anybody complain about him. I've never heard anybody he's a dick like, fuck you, you know. I've never heard anything bad about him. I think he'll be back. 